upon is called to order. If I could ask um, Center Elin Yamashita if you can lead us uh, in prayer. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Dear Lord, as we convene uh, the special session to address our financial issues across our island, please give us the wisdom and the insight, the patience, um, the openness of mind, uh, the critical thinking skills that it will take to ensure that what all families need to proceed with life uh, throughout our island so that we are safe and so that we are healthy and so that we can live and work well together. Please give each of us the, um, the wisdom to come together and to listen and to make those, dis those decisions. For this we pray. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> Senator Specio, can you lead us in the recitation of the Inefresi? Uh, Inefresi. Ginini mastakalo gina soko, imastakalum gi kurasonho, zani mastigo nani nasinahu, who are fresh in my sezo, parabayo protehi, zanu defendi, i hinengi, i katura, i linguahi, i airi, i hanam zani tano tomorrow, ni iren shako diretsun, ginin as jos tata, esti who are fit me gihilo i bibla, biblia, zani banderahu, i bandaran guahan. Senator uh, Taihirun, if you can lead us in singing the uh, Fanogi Chamorro and Senator Rodriguez in the national anthem. Fanogi Chamorro, Purita Nota, Kantai Matu Nanyagi Toru Iluga. Just my seat. Very good, guys. Roll call. Roll call. Senator Tom Ada. Senator Tony Ada. Senator Bloss. Vice Speaker Cruz. 
Senator Duenas. Senator Guthards. <coughs> Senator Mabini. Present. Senator Munio Barnes. Senator Palacios. Senator Penglinen. Senator Respicio. Senator Rodriguez. Here. Senator Silva Tyron. <coughs> Speaker Wampet. Present. Senator Yamashita. Madam Speaker, I wish to report there is a quorum. Thank you very much, uh, Majority Leader. You're recognized. Madam Speaker, <coughs> I move that uh, Senators Tom Mata and our legislative secretary, Tina Rose Munya Barnes, be uh, And Senator excused. Chris Duenas. And Senator Chris Duenas, as they are presently uh, off island. On that motion, then, without any objections, so ordered. And I'd just like to um, note for the record that uh, Senator Penginen uh, is here, Madam Speaker, but uh, as we know, he's still. Uh, crunching the, um, the numbers and the, uh, the amendments that, that need to be made to the governor's supplemental budget. We just, uh, he just received the governor's response to your letter uh, yesterday, late afternoon, and so I'm sure his office has been working since then. So I just moved that we recognize and allow that he be uh, excused uh, <coughs> tardy. So on that motion without any objections to order. M Madam Speaker, I move that we approve the legislative journal dated May 2nd to May 10, subject to correction. Well, that motion without any objections, <coughs> so ordered. Madam Speaker, there are communications and petitions, and I move that uh, these communications and petitions be appended to today's session journal. On the motion, without objections, so ordered. Same with uh, messages from Imagalahim Guahan, I move that they also be appended to the session journal. On that motion, without objection, so ordered. Uh, Madam Speaker, there are reports of standing committees, and I move for the same. On the motion, without <coughs> objection, so ordered. And there are no reports from <coughs> select committees uh, at this time. But on item 12, Madam Speaker, I move that bill numbers 192-31 to bill number 224-31 be given its first reading. On that motion, <coughs> without any objections, so And ordered. for resolutions 107 to 128, Dash 31, I also move that they be given its first reading. On that motion, without objections. And Madam Speaker, same with the certificates uh, number 37-31 to 56-31, I also move that they be give, given its first reading. Hearing no objections, so ordered. <coughs> We're in motions. Um, Madam Speaker, will you be making a motion to uh, override veto Bill 155? No. You're making that motion? No, will you? I mean. No. Wait. Okay. <clears throat> so my first motion is that uh, any bill, any uh, resolutions of commendatory or <coughs> condolence in nature that's uh, introduced the course of this session uh, be adopted and that all senators be co-sponsors and that the sponsor work with the clerk and the legislative council in the preparation of these, uh, these certificates or resolutions. On that motion, then, without any objections, so ordered. Um, Madam Speaker, um, as I said earlier, uh, the Office of Finance and Budget and the Chairman on Appropriations, uh, Senator Pengalinen, uh, is presently uh, working to revise the supplemental budget uh, based on a response that the Governor gave uh, to you. And uh, having just said that, Madam Speaker, I move then that we recess until <coughs> 11 o'clock, uh, at which time our colleagues will have a time that time to review that version of that bill, uh, and then we can decide how to proceed from there. On that motion, then, without any objections, so ordered. <clears throat> so we will then um, recess until about 11 o'clock this morning. The Hesler Turn Guahan is back to order. I recognize the Majority Leader, Senator Especio. Thank you very much, uh, Madam Speaker. Madam Speaker, uh, true to his word, our Appropriations Chair, Speaker Pangalinen, uh, has um, submitted for our review the supplemental budget uh, at 11 a.m. this morning. And for the last uh, half hour, we've been uh, photocopying uh, that document. It is uh, 60 uh, plus pages, and I'm afraid that we need a little bit more time to finish photocopying as well as uh, some time to review uh, that document before going back into session. So at this time, I respectfully move that we recess and come back at 1 o'clock. That motion without any objection, so ordered. We'll be in recess until 1 o'clock this afternoon.